Welcome to the quick hitter version of the Mike Wise Show. I'm joined by my guest, Bruce Bernstein, my producer. Hey, look, this Trey Young guy, this is one of the great little big men in NBA history. I'm, I'm afraid, Bruce. Trey Young is, all right, true or false, okay. Trey Young is greater than Isaiah Thomas, Allen Iverson, and Calvin Murphy combined. He will be the greatest 6'2 and under guy ever to play. Hyperbole or fact, Mike Wise? Oh man, you got me with that one there. I, you know, I, I, I think it's hyperbole, I, um, and this is why. I don't think Trey Young is just a basketball player. I think he's going to retire greater than Jesus, Gandhi, um, and and possibly King Kamehameha the first of Hawaii. This is a player that. All right. Well, okay. I. I I confess to getting on the Trey Young bandwagon because he's just so fun to watch. I don't know if he becomes that good over his career. I don't know if his health stays. I don't know what kind of players they surround him with in Atlanta, whether he stays a Hawk, whatever. Right now, I could see him on that trajectory. I think he's if he's not, if he's not going to be better than those guys, I see him in the category of the best little big men ever to play this game. Ever. Calvin Murphy, Nate Archibald, Isaiah Thomas, um, the first Isaiah Thomas, the IT, the second was, you know, a nice little player that had injuries and got shipped around a lot. But I'm telling you, I, I just feel like this guy has something special that it's not even a it's not even a shot. It's not even his game. It's his what do you call that French word? Je ne sais quoi. Ah. He has that special something that just emanates from it oozes from his uh from his body and it's it's the bow at madison square garden it's a blowing the kisses to the crowd it's the it's the putting his finger against his lips like Shh, i just quieted you bastards i don't care how many people are in madison square garden right now you know calling for my execution I am silencing your crowd, including you spike lee you bastard who hasn't been in a big series since Reggie Miller I don't know if you ever read Phil Mushnick's column in the New York Post. Phil's kind of a bitter old guy, you know, oh, he's, he's a type good. of a guy. Oh, he, he makes he makes us he makes us look like um, woke twenty year olds. He's, but he, he's like but he the, let he let Spike Lee have it in the column that that dropped today. It was actually pretty funny. He called like him, about what? Well, he said, you know, why is he always standing up? He's sitting in the front row. Nobody's blocking his view. He's just, you know, he, I'm not, I'm not saying these are my words because, you know, Spike Lee seems okay. You love, no, no, no. You loved it. You He's loved a, he it. He called him a clown. you hate Spike. Spike Lee is an American treasure and he can run around the court as much as he wants. In fact, I would, but because he's so tiny, it's like part of the show. I, I would be I would be honored if Spike Lee danced past me and I, I had spent that much money for those seats. I would be honored because yeah. even though he's showboating, it's his moment. He's he isn't. I mean, he's he's as connected to that franchise uh, even more so than Billy Crystal to the Clippers or shoot Jack Nicholson. Like yeah. you see them. Yeah, he is. He is. Yeah. Yeah, so he I is. don't know. I, I but I'll read much Nick because you know. Um, well, he basically just all, called he, him a clown. He said, you know, he's wearing his little clown suit and blah blah blah. And it's like, well, you know what? I look at Spike and I say, you know, he's been showing up for a really long time. So it's not like he decided all of a sudden to jump on the bandwagon with the Knicks. He's he's been there all along. But uh, Trey Young, man, I'll tell you what. When he gets over half court, he's ready to shoot it. I mean, it's almost oh. Steph Curry like, and 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 when he lets that thing go, I mean, it, it looks pretty good coming out of his hands pretty much every time. So I mean, you know. I mean, if Steph Curry declared himself open when he left the parking lot, Trey Young declared himself open when he left the womb. If you want to hear more from Bruce and myself, check out the full version of the Mike Wise Show from Pure Hoops Media. You can also see the video version of The Quick Hitter on the Pure Hoops Media YouTube channel.